Welcome back to Relatable Reactions. It's Josh, and you've joined me for more sliders. Uh, one thing I did want to mention off the bat was that maybe this episode and the previous one are the wrong way around because of the way Amazon Prime have them listed. They have them listed going the, the way I've done it. But on IMDb, they have these two episodes switched. So I think there's a good chance that it could be the way it's supposed to be. Maybe someone in the comments can let me know. Uh, maybe there's a reason for it that I just don't know about. I'm sure it won't matter too much in the grand scheme of things. But let's just jump straight into the episode. Sliders. Let's go. Oh, it's Conrad. He's been in this quite a lot, hasn't he, considering? Conrad Bennis Jr.? Maybe. Who wants to know? FBI. Yeah, dude. Oh, hey, if it's about that bong I just bought, I thought it was a plant holder. Classic excuse. Oh, is this maybe actually on their their actual real world? Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! This guy's a genius. Don't judge a book by its cover. Quinn Mallory, advanced physics student, specialist in super strength theory. Sir Maximilian P. Arturo, Wade Kathleen Wells, Quinn's co-worker. These three individuals have been missing since Tuesday, Mr. Benish. We have reason to believe a fourth individual may also have disappeared. Rembrandt Brown. Hey, look, I don't know anything, all right? But you do know about the bridge. Just last week, Conrad Benish and I were discussing the einstein rosen Podolsky bridge. And now, I've crossed it. Is that possible? You need to maintain quantum coherence over a macroscopic compact region of time and space. If they've crossed the bridge, that's why they're missing? It means they may have journeyed to a parallel Earth. Who would have thought there would be other scientists they could probably ask about that? You what's the matter <laughs> next time we slide what will you fail hey this could be home right i mean technically any of them could be home then where is everybody well look at the bright side at least it's peaceful and quiet that is true because it won't last that way i'm sure it seems to be the problem oh the timer needs a rest the swarm is emerging from the south swarm? evacuated the city yeah maybe get inside spider wasp is a hybrid creature a queen escaped from the compound in 1987. The brood she fostered has moved 2,000 miles north. Immunity to pesticides. Spider wasps are yet to be slowed. I think we'd better get indoors. Yeah, get inside now. Walls renders most buildings extremely vulnerable to attack. Maybe not. The timer may be messed up, Quinn, but we've got to go. I wonder how this works, because sometimes they seem to be dead against, like, just launching into a new parallel dimension when it seems like it would be a wise decision. But other times... Oh. Okay, I was not expecting that. Couple got through, though. Couple got through. Definitely gonna think there are gods. Prophets have arrived. Prophets, yeah. When the gate closed, it must have shut off the tunnel Wade and Rembrandt were sliding through. It's gotta be the same place. You mind having a look at my back? <laughs> Is it about to do a... <laughs> Here's something nasty. Get it off, please. <laughs> Quick. Hold perfectly still. Oh! <laughs> I was kind of hoping it was going to hit him in the face, got to be honest. They're not coming, are they? They never made it through. Whatever this place is, we're here for keeps. Yeah, it'd be a lot a lot scarier for these two than the other two. At least they've got a way off. Can you guys tell us where we are? You're at our commune, man. Inside of San Francisco. What year is it? It's 1995. Check, check. Who's the president? Oliver North, man. Who? Was he a real person or is it just one they've made up? I hated the 60s when it was the 60s. Wade and Rembrandt are probably on an alternate earth and they have no idea how much I envy them. Go away! Definitely could be worse though. You've definitely been on worse places. Man, oh man, this is heaven on earth. He is having a good time. Do you ladies know me? I mean, is that why you're doing all of this? Kid recognized you the moment you landed. When he told us who you were, we nearly dropped to our knees. Damn. 
<laughs> I wasn't sure the crime man had made a mark in this world. My companion wakes up. Could you tell her that I've gone into town to look for our, well, our other companions? You're going to take one of our cars yourself. Well, how many cars you got? Uh, nine. 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 Are they stolen? Oh, hardly, man. Seeker's father owns half of India. You know, I used to live in that house years ago. It's like some kind of party going on. Think they mind if I took a peek inside? That could be anything. It could be a funeral or something. Be like a wake. Gathered here today to honor the memory. Okay, it actually is a wake. Rembrandt Brown. Oh. When the telegram arrived saying Rembrandt was missing in action, my whole world collapsed. Rembrandt was a good father, a loving husband, and most of all, the best friend anyone could have. It'd be so weird watching your own funeral. I'm Shazam Brown. Rembrandt's big brother. Right on, right on. Right on, right on. Right on, right on. I just want him to know that, well, that I forgive him for all the times that he let me down. <laughs> well, Remy liked his music. Oh, Even thought about <laughs> trying to make a career of it at some point. Could I help it that the Lord blessed me with more musical talent? Uh-oh. You couldn't carry a tune if it was strapped to your back. Yeah, it's probably not a good idea. You're supposed to be dead. <laughs> What's your ad? Oh, yeah. Sharon? Really you? My love, you've come back to us. It's a miracle from God. Everyone, it's no longer awake. It's a celebration. She doesn't look that happy. Maybe she's shocked, I don't know. Hey, you know I was only jiving, man. <laughs> I knew you were there the whole time. <laughs> I'm not offended because I'm not really your brother. I'm from another dimension, a whole other planet. That woman there, Sharon, I had the biggest crush on her in high school, but I never had the guts to ask her out. Now we're married, and she worships the ground I walk on. Are we talking about the same Sharon? <laughs> this is paradise. This is the life I was meant to live. It's all clear to me now. What are you saying? I'm saying that I'm still. I can start my musical career all over again. I'll be bigger than I ever was back home. Such a thing is possible. He never doubts his self-confidence. I do like that. I I'm gonna let you two talk. Right on, right on. Right on, right on. Did we go to the prom together? Don't you remember? Something wrong with your memory? Yeah, that's it. I, uh, I kind of lost some of my recall temporarily. I know you've been fooling around on me over there. But tonight, I'm going to remind you Home cooking is all Oh, that makes such a hard decision. You want to leave, but you definitely want to stay. Timer is useless in its present condition. It would seem prudent that we put our collective genius together if ever we are to get home. Of course, I'll do whatever it takes to get us home. Surely that's always been the goal, isn't it? Furnished law for rent on a monthly basis. No pets, radicals, draft dodgers, musicians, or other counterculture types allowed. Ever spit on the flag? Certainly not. <laughs> I won't allow any sympathizing with the Outback Kong under my roof. Understood? Outback Kong. If South Australia fall, it's just a hop, skip, and a jump to our shores. Can't have that. Boomerangs and kangaroos everywhere? What a nightmare. You will have to forgive my kid brother. Brother? I thought you said he was your father. Well, I am. <laughs> I am. I had him when I was very, very young. Oh, those hot summers of one's promiscuous youth, you remember? I don't think she'll like that. Don't worry, Mrs. Tweak. We're A-OK. -okay. Right? Dad? Daddy or Toro, that's probably not the best thing to say. FBI informant line. I just rented my law Again. at 14 Bale Street to two subversives, lied about who they were, and referred to, quote, uh, promiscuous youth. I believe they have come to kill the president. As a concerned citizen, <laughs> I... I don't want to mess with her, do you? Blow your head off. I think we gotta bring these two in dead or alive. Sounds like she might go do it herself. God knows what she's gonna think when she sees all that written up on a wall. Oh, the schematics of this are proving to be intriguingly difficult. It will take us many hours of sustained computation to come up with a satisfactory conclusion. Remember, we need clothes and food in the morning. I'll take care of it, Professor. I wonder if that's more efficient doing it that way than just both sleeping and resting. Look, that woman is hell on wheels. Pull me out. Hello, Junior. Uh, I was just commenting on what a wonderful woman your mom is. Say, 
We both know the score. Whoa, looks like mine's got to do some shopping. Who you kidding? Now that you're home, you'll be doing all the shopping. No man on earth is whipped as you. What? <laughs> and you better clean up the house and fix her coffee before she wakes up. She'll kick your tail for good if you don't get to it. Rembrandt, bring me my morning coffee and make sure it's hot. Better get to it, Rembrandt. Got a list of chores for you, so get hopping. Come on now. It's no wonder he joined the army, probably to get away. What happens when you die? Well, I can't say I've never died. She's immortal. Of course she is, man. I could have told you that. We feel our movement will sweep the world. The summer of love will never end. Mm, definitely does. Please tell us that's true. Yes, it's, it's true. Oh, oh, Thank you. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, it's a different parallel universe, so maybe it would last. She wouldn't know either way. Next time she comes in here, I'm going to give her a piece of my mind. I really am. And who was that at the door? Army telegram. Gave it to mom first. Dear Mrs. Brown, pleased to inform you that Sergeant First Class Rembrandt Lee Brown has been rescued from the outback. Is expected to fully recover. He will be contacting you shortly. She's in the bedroom loading up. What? Did you say loading up? Now that she knows you're an imposter. She's gonna teach you a lesson as soon as she finds some shells for a shotgun. Yeah, just just run and get out. Jaff turkey. I bought us some clothes at a second hand store. Well that's that's damnably kind of you, my boy. Well done. Is we'll see, this um... some kind of joke, Mr. Mallory? Yes. Now, let's get back to this equation. No, I solved that already. What? Mm, it wasn't that hard. <laughs> there is a window of opportunity. A precise moment when we can access the gate. FBI, open up! Oh, that's not good. If you move a muscle, I'll have to blow your head off. That's the same people, but switched around. So you got any idea what they're trying to cook up? Could be some kind of elaborate pipe bomb. Pipe bomb? You blistering idiot! <laughs> I to that. <laughs> it's not the right words. Not the right words at all, right? It's nothing like a pipe band, Bob. It's, 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 it's a... Rembrandt! Rembrandt! It was a crime man. He didn't see me, but I'm going to stop him. No, you're not going anywhere. Drop your gun! Okay, now. Go. After him, Mr. Mallory. Quick. See, now he use that thing. He probably does at this point, actually. They've certainly been on a few worlds now. Tripping. Look at that food. <laughs> Come on. You can see him. <laughs> How quick is he at running if he's got this far? Whoa, look at that. He's got some skills. The problem with the Australian conflict is it's an undeclared war. A war run by politicians playing for a stalemate. It's likely to go on for a long time without resolution. And a lot of good people are going to die. I'm not advising you not to go. Leave the girl alone for a day or two and she becomes a full-fledged guru. Quinn! <laughs> that was remarkably stupid of you, Miss Wade. You know nothing of this world, nothing of their war. Some truths are universal. If we can bring some of the things that we've learned on our world to parallel cultures, then I say go for it. We've not learned that getting involved is pretty bad. Oh, we better go. Come on. Make sure they don't hold you up. All you need is love. Love, love is all you need. Love and peace. 48 minutes till the next window. Unless this is home. There's something y'all should know. I can't swim. That would be my worst nightmare. And that is the end of episode four or five of Sliders. Starting to lose count now. Not too sure. I think that was the fifth one. And I could definitely see the continuity things that this was probably supposed to be or the previous one. So no idea why Amazon have switched them around. I 
feel like there must be a reason unless it's just a genuine mistake but maybe as i said before someone in the comments might be able to let me know as a reasoning but yeah it was a strange episode because it was quite slow and not not too much happened in it like quinn managed to fix the problem with the the sliding controller portal thing it, but he seems to manage to fix that rather easily without that much hassle it was more just the luck of them finding each other right towards the end we got a look at rembrandt and what his life might have been like if he had married his childhood sweetheart you know sometimes it's not always greener when we break up and we think life is over but you know maybe it's not maybe it, maybe there's a brighter outlook i'm sure we've all been there in a breakup and and come out better for it the episode definitely gave me a few laughs though so even though not too much happened we got that brief glimpse early on with the fbi turning up at quinn's house which i presume must be his original their original universe and them sort of trying to figure out what had happened and i quite liked the crossover that we saw in where they are now with the fbi and the the roles that seem to have switched uh the woman seemed to be the the lead investigator where it was the man in the at the start but yeah not too much to say apart from that i still enjoyed it i look forward to getting into the next episode so i will catch you later